Hello, Wilkins, and welcome back. I hope the camera shaking is not too bad. Um, I just wanted to share with you a few things that were on my mind. One, the smoothie is absolutely delicious, okay? And it's like a deep lilac purple color. It's so good. It's blue, uh, wild blueberries, bananas, almond milk, and a little bit of cinnamon. Ah, oh, it's so good. Okay. But I want to take you with me for a second and show you how easy it is to bump up your flavor in your dishes. It's real easy. Just come with me. All right, so um, right here I have half a cup of rice. Um, typically I do more, about one cup, but I'm just trying this out, so I don't want to waste um, too much uh, materials because we are living in a pandemic. And in this pot, I have some vegetable broth. And it just gives the rice just a little bit more flavor than using water. Um, I use vegetable broth and no chicken chicken broth. It's all vegan. Um, to just add a little bit more flavorings to um, certain noodles. And what I'm going to add to it is this tomato bean mixture. And in there there is some chili powder, boom, boom. some garlic powder, boom, boom. and some onion powder. Um, I really like those spices in my Mexican inspired dishes um, just because they just add a really good flavor. But my husband and I have really been liking that combination with a touch of cinnamon. I know what you're thinking, that's a little strange, but trust me, it works. Some cumin, but not very much. Some cilantro flakes, dried. Um, and some lime juice. Okay, this is real easy. Okay, um, you just mix all of those together with your beans or whatever you want to make, and it is delicious. Like, no joke. And given that we are living in pandemic times, I think it's real easy to make. I mean, it doesn't really use all that much ingredients, but sorry putting my rice in real quick. Um, now I need to stir it. But it doesn't really need to be all that fancy or, you know, uh, whatever. It just, it just needs to taste good, really. <laughs> and so I'm going to let this sit. First I need to find the cover for this and I will be right back really don't think that is going to take very long because it is so little of an amount but I think it's it's gonna be really good I'm also going to add just a smidge of turmeric um, and that is weird isn't it <laughs> oh, but anyways yeah we go through so much of this um, that it is just way easier to buy in bulk. And I can fill up about five of these containers for the same price as one. I mean, it's just ridiculous. <laughs> um, so definitely buy in bulk. You will save a lot of money. So, um, yeah, 
I think that is all I wanted to share with you guys today. Um, just a quick little uh, recipe meal thing, and then I will taste it and give you my feedback in just a moment. <laughs> Alright, see you in a bit. Okay, so I just wanted a quick mention. This would be really good with some lettuce cups. Um, the rice and the beans and the tomatoes. You could even add um, bell peppers, onions, um, garlic, chipotle. <laughs> Alright, so let's try this thing, shall we? So this is what it looks like. Can't really show you all too much because I don't want it to fall. But I have on the rice some nutritional yeast. And on the beans and tomatoes, hot sauce, because as we all know, love the hot sauce. I put it on basically everything. So we will give this a try um, together. <laughs> the rice is like a yellow because I think of two things. One, the vegetable broth. And then also um, a little bit of turmeric. Um, and I did put a little bit of pepper. Ooh, it's hot. Mm -hmm. That's really good. I really do like that. It just has like a kick to it because, well, the hot sauce, but also the flavorings. And I mean, I just really like that little hint of cinnamon poking through in the background. And then that lime, which just kind of like gives it that acidity and like saltier kind of taste. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Really good. I really hope that um, you enjoyed this. I know it was kind of a short video, but that's okay. Um, please make this and tell me what you liked, what you added, um, what could improve. Also, don't forget to try that smoothie in the beginning. Oof, that is some good stuff. That actually is really good after and before workouts. So, with a little bit of flax seeds as well. That's really good. Um, you can also put oats in there. That's also really good. Alright, I think that does it for us today. Um, I hope that you guys are staying safe out there with this COVID thing. And um, keep social distancing. And don't forget to wear a mask. I wish I had mine nearby so I could show you mine. It has little cactuses. Um, Alright, well, I hope that you guys have a great day, and thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to hit that like button, the subscribe button.